Uh, for me, it's really great training. That's our uh, first point. And uh, another point is it's uh, I try to keep on working on my technical skills, which are getting every year worse, worse and worse. And uh, also on the explosivity, which uh, it's actually nearly impossible to train on your own. But in um, in the race, you are really pushed to go just hard, and I get uh, slower, as I say. But in the sense that I don't, I'm not so explosive anymore. I have more power, and I recover much better between the races. So that's really a big difference from the years before, because I know that the, like when I had to do two races in a row, I was really really tired. But like now today, I'm gonna start on a third race in a row, and tomorrow fourth race in a row, which I have never done before and the body just recover much faster and uh, but really just just you know from the doing many kilometers and many hours on the bike just the body is really changing you know until now i'm really happy with uh, with the group it's uh, even in the worst conditions what you can have actually it's uh, it's working always very good so um, it's really it's like actually sometimes i'm even impressed that uh, it's still possible that it's shifting when you see all the dirt on it, grass in between, little stones, sand, and it's still uh, keep on working. I think that's uh, that's all what we need. You know, the objectives for cyclocross are are just to have fun. That's only one objective for me because you know, like those races, like in Zolder, like yesterday in Lunard, it's uh, I could for sure take it more easy, don't pull that hard and just really focus maybe for better result, the same as in Zolder. But I just hate to stay in the wheels and just look around and see who, who will pull on the head. And uh, on the road, the yeah, that's are just the spring classics. I, it's really like I'm gonna do it for a second time. So it's still like I have to learn a lot. Uh, but we have very experienced guys as uh, Tom Bonen, for example, Nicky Terpstra in the team. So. I have guys from who I can learn and uh, and then I hope that uh, I can make some nice results. Mm. In cyclocross they are much closer to us, the supporters to the riders, they you know they see us all day long actually, like uh, once we arrive then you, know, you can see that the people are coming already and then they see you on the track with warming up Then they see you before the race on the rulers and they see you in the race and after the race and then still when you leave out of shower then they still stand there and they still want to take picture with you and signature and then all these things so they have like actually when they come to the race they see you all day long and uh, on the road it is, they see you just maybe a few seconds or, or when it's like for example on the Flanders so they see you three times on uh, Quarmont uh, so it's something else.